Hey everybody, what's going on? Jerome here, and I have you guys an awesome episode of Pixelmon, and in this episode, me and Mitch get a little bit mischievous, and I'm not gonna say how, but we somehow get two Firestones, you'll have to find out how that one works out, but it gets really interesting from there, and we have a lot of fun, but I do want to thank you all for watching, hope you all enjoy, and of course, if you do, remember click on that like button, let's go for 15,000 likes, as we always do on Pixelmon, especially being we're coming to a close really soon, less than 10 episodes left in this series, so let's push through, let's power through, get as many likes and as much enjoyment out of this series as possible, as we move into the new Pixelmon series that'll be coming out soon enough. So thank you, everybody. Jerome, I have the best idea ever. I, I like the sound of this. It sounds really good. Well, it's a little nefarious if you're okay with that. That... okay. <laughs> well, we need two more Firestones, correct? Yeah. You go check Doc Q's house. I'm gonna investigate Ian's. I don't think we should do this one, buddy. It's a little nefarious, I know, but... We got some investigating to do, and without us, you know, who else is going to do the investigating? That is true. I think, I, think, I think this is very necessary. Much need. Much need. Oh, Doc never filled up his house. Does that mean it's, I think it's still in his backup house, or his backup backup house. That's all right. Let's check in here. We have a little inquiry to make at Ian's house. Let's uh, see. Why does he have so many rotten fleshes? Is this... Maybe he doesn't use his house anymore, because... Didn't I do this ages ago, put all the rotten flesh? I don't know, did you? I must, like, why else would he have so much rotten flesh spread out? Well, he might be, that might be his underwater layer, remember that one? Maybe. I could check there. Yeah, because he's got so much rotten flesh. Unless this was a prank. No, Quinn's backup house has nothing. Let me see his secret passageway if there's anything. Oh! <laughs> a lot. The investigating was a smart move. Oh, what? He had five? No, I'm just kidding. He only has one. But that's one enough. Oh my god. We're horrible, horrible people. We'll just, we're, we're loaning it out, buddy. We'll give yeah, him one as soon as we get one. Yeah, we'll repay it. We'll repay it at a later date. Don't worry about it. Don't worry about a thing. Oh, <laughs> uh, well, Don't you know, it's not our fault. Someone it. had to be in charge of the investigating on the server, and I mean, they weren't going to step up to the plate, so we did. Exactly, and I just found a yellow gold duck, or you know, like yellow named a boss. Nice. Maybe Level one hundred eleven? Are you absurd? You know, if I had to fight it for you, I'll take it out. What is wrong with this game? Did, did Betty just die? No, no. I uh, what is it? I threw, I took Betty out because I wanted it to actually win the fight. So I'm using my Jagmaster now, and I'm gonna pedal dance this gold duck to death. Here oh, we go. Very good. Very good. Oh my god, that barely did anything, even though it's like super, super effective. Ice beam! Boom. Here we go. Oh my god. I barely got anything done with him. Alright, um... Outrage time then! Come on, Rayquaza! <laughs> there it is. Yeah, I'm gonna be able to finish him up. Level 111, that's insane. Yeah, isn't it 40 levels higher than your highest? Yeah, but I got another timer ball, great ball, net ball. I thought it was a master ball for a second. I was like, oh! <gasps> Reflect, Calm Mind, Ornberry, Power Weight, Super... Power Weight? Power Weight? I already have one of those. Uh, Mitch, I have no room for these items. Do you want them? Nope. But I, I can't pick them up. I have too many other important items in my inventory. Alright, let me just destroy this mill tank real quick. Alright, I'm here! There we go. I have only... I have, like, my inventory is filled with just important items, like, uh other types of TMs and stuff, so I couldn't throw any out, and I couldn't pick any up, and I was like, oh. Yeah, let's go back to the base, drop all this loot off, because I am pretty maxed out too soon. I only have like four slots, so let's just d dump these all off and do a quick ceremony. Oh, there's a Drift Bloom. Hey! <laughs> I don't Ice think we ever key. said this, so welcome to Pixelmon, everybody. That's right. And let me, yeah, I'm going to try to back off the house. Go. They, they're having a lick fight? They definitely are. Oh, that's not good. Those usually end violently. <laughs> well, for one of them, it ends pretty poorly, that's for sure. Oh my wow, God. our chests are all full. I know, all of our specific Pixelmon chests, too. They're just... What the heck? There's no room left. Alright, making more chests. There we go. It's just the new Pixelmon chest? I guess so. There's our Firestone. That we totally got for reals. There we go. Oh, is that a weird barrel? Oh, a Rossberry for burns. 
Cool. I don't need any of that. <sighs> Keep the nether rack with me just for the lols. Ooh, an orange berry. Let me put that away too. There we go. I'll keep this great ball because I like my balls to be great. Whoa, a choice scarf, nice. It's a good reason. Looks cool. I don't know what it does. Well, it's your choice, Mitch. <laughs> my god. It's pretty obvious what it does. <laughs> nice. Alright, so what are you doing? Are you using the Firestone on Flareon or, or Arcanine? Well, I got to do the last evolution with the Moonstone. So this one, oh, I put it away. Whoops. Oh, well, that gives me time to get my, uh, my Flareon anyway. You doing Flareon or are we doing Arcanine? Uh, yeah, Flareon, why not? Da, 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 da. Firestone's at your feet. So you can take the blame for the investigation. Fine. We gotta investigate Q's house, because what if he has a fat stack of them? Dude, I have no clue where Q's house is. It's ridiculous. <laughs> well, I guess someone's gotta do it, so I'll start investigating. There we go. Eevee is evolving. Yes, thank you for noticing. That's oh, kind of what happens when you put the Firestone on him. Yeah, I'll, I'll wait. I'll, I'll watch the ceremony. And... Uh, yep. Toss him out. Toss him out. Pew! Ooh! Look at that. It honestly just looks like a grown-up Eevee Flareon. Yeah, I know, doesn't it? Alright. Well, one more Firestone to go. Let's do it. All right, so Q's house and Q's backup house don't have it, so I think we have to check his underwater oh, backup exactly. house. Exactly, that's where I'm heading to right now is the underwater. I think it's over this way. I could be wrong, though. I think I have to turn left here, yeah. All right, oh, fly gone. There we go. I like their little five-part adventure where we went off and just tried to get... Pokemon as fast as possible, like the best one. Oh, the ones. new one, and then we battled. That was pretty fun. I like that. Maybe we'll do it again. I found the underground. You did? Da, 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 da. Oh, that was relatively quick. Whoa, it looks like it got attacked by something. There's no lights. Oh, well, thank God I have Gamma at a thousand. Wait, where'd my torches just go? I had a stack of 27 torches that just disappeared on me. I oh, ate well. them. Are these all empty? I think, unless they have a sign on them, they're empty. Balls, TMs, there's this one right here. Oh my god, there's a lot of TMs. <laughs> Wearable items. He's got two Firestones! Yeah! That's no right. way. Now, do we just rob him once? Or do we rob it? We don't even know if this is Doc Q's or not. That's the best part. We don't even know who we're stealing from right well, now. Well, I think you should put one back. Which we don't need both. Oh, you did. Okay. But yeah. do we return to Ian or do we leave it here? Oh, leave it here. I mean, okay, one from each, you know. Yeah, yeah. All right. Um, he's got four Everstones. Dang. Why do you need Everstones? I don't know. Choice spectacles. Here, I'm gonna go. It's orange, so I'm gonna go put in the Firestone spot where we got from Ian. I'm gonna put some choice spectacles. <laughs> oh my God. <laughs> oh, you can't go up this way. Dang it. Apparently, there's a Short drowsy time. up there, though. Oh, that works too. Yeah, I took the shortcut. So now you gotta evolve the Growlithe, Mitch. I know, I know. I'm gonna just go put the choice spectacles where they belong. Do you think whoever owns that place keeps track of all five spectacles? Because I took one. I think so. I don't even know what the choice spectacles do. Oh, no. Alright. There we go. They'll never know the difference. Right. And this will give us a straight shot to Pokemon number 134. Wow. Oh, wait, no, because that'll be... That's Vaporeon. So no, let's get a straight shot to 137. Which I think is Porygon. And then it's just about the fossils. Let's do it. Alright. Let me get... Oh, let me get the time. Flareon out for you so you can actually get the Pokemon. I already got Flareon. Oh, you did? When? Uh, when we were in the house. No. I'm gonna get you Vaporeon because you clearly need that poop. Unless he vanished on me too. Oh my god, Mitch. If I have to go water stone hunting this episode. <laughs> well, at least that one's an easy one. Yeah, I know, right? That's a lot easier than fire stones, at least. Ah, oh, I found it. Yeah, buddy. Alright. So that's for you. And that's for the stone. Boom! Vaporeon. Hey, Growlithe. 
How you doing? <laughs> He's about to become a big boy. You could do this, Growlithe. Look at Uncle Steve over there. Oh my god, I can't believe I still need Zapdos. No! <laughs> Zapdos? Oh, I can give that to you. Easy peasy. No, you can't, remember? No, Moltres is what you need. Arcanine! Wait. Oh yeah, that's right, I need Moltres. Arcanine, stand still. Yay! I think. Yay! No, no, not yay. How did I not... Oh. Yeah. He looks pretty dope. Why is Arcanine not appearing in my Pokedex? Let me see. Growlithe? Whenever I right-click him... There he is! That was weird. Took three, three, three times to charm. But I got him. Very nice. Oh, that's beautiful. Alright, so I'm gonna put those two away. And now the quest for me to get a Moltres and for you to get the Mew and then I guess we'll have to do the the uh, fossil Pokemon. But I mean, do we have enough balls? For what? To capture those two. No, not at all. Do we need balls? Oh, your microwave. I have nine Ultra Balls and a Great Ball on me. I guess I'll hunt down Mew. <laughs> Actually, why don't we do Moltres first? Cause, or no, here, just give me all your balls. You don't need to catch the Moltres. That's true. I'll give you all three of them. What? I put all the timer balls away, though, so. Oh, okay, I'll go grab those. Pew, 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 pew. Took you 37 balls? Took me 27, thank you very much. Oh, yeah, I gave you 30, that's right. So, wait a minute, where do I go for... Is it Moltres? Moltres yeah. is Extreme Hills. Alright, so I'll be over in this direction then. Alright, I'm looking for some balls. Looking for some balls. Timer ball. We got two in this chest. On Moon ball. Don't really know what that does, so I'll take them. Boom or boon? Moon, M O O N. Oh, okay. Damn, moon ball. And I'll take some. I don't know, what does a heel ball do? Hmm. I don't know. It would look pretty dope to have a Mew inside of a, a heel ball. It's pink. So extreme hills, right? You sure? Yeah. Yeah. Oh, because I'm already there. Some extra timer balls. So that's it then? I just hang around here and poof? And then poof, there it is. Wow, that seems a little easy. Ten more timer balls. Two more moon balls. All right. Yeah, and I'm pretty sad. There's a jungle right next to here too, so if you want to TP to me and look for that Mew. I'm just checking for extra Ultra Balls if we have any laying around somewhere. Nope. It's no bueno. Alright, might as well get some training done while I'm out here, right? Yeah, I guess so. Maybe yeah. find a shinier tent or a boss yeah. so we can return the Firestone for real. <laughs> yeah, I got a camera up right here. We are actually gonna, though, viewers out there that are angry, we are actually gonna, of course, return them as soon as we get them. What would you be angry about? I bet you both of them don't even need it. That's why they're it's in a chest. No, it's true. They don't, because they both have, like, a ridiculous amount of Pokemon, but... <laughs> <laughs> Plus, I gave him choice spectacles from the unknown house. We that don't know true. who owns it. Could be anybody. Could, could even be, be ours. You know, yeah, exactly. Could be ours from another life. We don't even know. You don't, and we'll never know. We'll never know, Mitch. Oh, that's a big <laughs> turd over there, though. How big? Sonic's. Plus, it's I just enormous. think it's pretty funny investigating. Oh yeah, of course. There we go. Wild Laron has fainted. Alright, let me out of the planes. I really don't want another Rayquaza coming in. Gyarados is getting there pretty quick. He's level 61 already. He's growing up. Nice! By the way, Jerome, I read in the comments once, there was an episode where I started the whole thing by Cliff jumping to my death while screaming, look, there's a yellow Geodude. Apparently it wasn't a boss Geodude, it was a shiny Geodude. <laughs> Are you serious? <laughs> and I just cliff dove in front of it and lost it, yeah. I saw a bunch of comments ye yelling at me for doing that. Oh my god, Mitch. Yeah. Why? Because I'm the best kind of person there. You have the gift of not being colorblind. You have one job, Mitch. One job. Wait, where'd that... I just saw a green... Um... Shinies are not my expertise. <laughs> I just saw a green graveler. Where'd he go? I was a boss graveler, he just vanished in front of my very eyes. I st stopped paying attention for a split second and he... Wow, he's actually gone. Wow. That could have been our Firestone right there. Could have. Should have. But wasn't. That's okay. That's how it works, Mitch, you know. I want them to add Growlon and the big, big 
blue whale thingy already. Oh, Groudon and Kyogre? Kyogre, yes. And have two Growl are awesome. Groudon should be desert. Kyogre is ocean. Easy. Finally, a legendary for more biomes. That is true. Huh. What's yeah, the why didn't they, they should add them in. You got Rayquaza, so what's the excuse? I don't know. Those but Kyogre would be so annoying to get. If you had to go out in the ocean and find it just swimming around, flapping its wings, or whatever it has. Are you kidding? Because it tells you when it spawns. You just sit in an ocean for a little while, and then, <laughs> there it is. I found Arthur, but he's only level 15. Oh, beat him up. Oh, my choke. Perfect, Hyper Beam. Have you noticed a lack of Beldum spawning, by the way? Oh, there's one. Perfect. <laughs> Actually, no. Now that you mention it. I guess just we haven't been to this biome in a long time. Now, I'm trying to find a nice jungle. I know there was one near our base, but... And I guess we already burnt that one down, too, so I should probably just go use that jungle. Yeah. I'll be smart. All right. If you insist. Oh, my God. I have to leave this place in a second because... Believe it or not, I've run out of all moves for my, my Betty. He's just destroyed everything in sight, repeatedly. <laughs> oh, this is bad news bears. Oh my god, he really? That ride on survived that? Alright. Chief Flef, Signal Beam, Boom Shagalaka. Isn't that a bug move? Yeah, I don't know why he knows it, but he does. <sighs> and there are a lot of ride What the heck? There are too many ride ons out here. In right. my plain sight, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. There are nine ride-ons in my line of sight. And? That's a lot of training. If my Gary wasn't dead. All right, all aboard the Dragonite Express. Let's go. We're going to hover above this forest for a bit. And we're out of the plains <gasps> and into the jungle. Boss Pidgey. Yes. Give me Firestone! <laughs> In the jungle, the mighty jungle. I got a power <laughs> bracer. Not a brace, power bracer. Nice, it's to keep your power contained. Oh, why would I want that? Never tell a man to power down. Revoke. <laughs> In the jungle, the mighty jungle, the mew sleeps there tonight. Hey, I found our Charmeleon Burial Ground from the first or so episode, like episode two or something. Nice. All right, there's no Pokemon Centers around here. I surrender, so slash kill. All right, Mew oh. spawns in jungle and forest biomes. Okay. That's good. I'm in the jungle. Do, 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 do. Do I just, like, I'm just going to keep flying around here for a bit. In the jungle. The mighty jungle, Mitch sleeps tonight. Ba -dum, ba -dum, ba -dum, ba -dum. Da -dum, da -dum, da -dum. Da -dum. Draw my thing. Ow, ow! The vines were slaughtering me. I think in a couple episodes here, we're gonna have to just go fossil hunting. I think so too. Cause we're making some serious headway. I guarantee you, we're gonna get the moo, the mew, uh, pretty soon here. Probably, if not next episode, the episode after that. I guarantee you'll have that. And same with my Moltres. I think Moltres is easier to find though. I don't really know how it works. Didn't Ashley find a Mew in like her first like two episodes or something insane? Yeah, yeah. And then rubbed it in our face. And that was before like the third generation when they were easy to find too. Yeah. And then rubbed it in our face, which was was sweet, you know. I really enjoyed that. That was back when I was constantly going through the jungles hoping to find Mew because I just wanted it for some reason. You really did want Mew a long time ago. Yeah, then I found that Mewtwo, and, and it was even better because I stole it from Ian. So I <laughs> really enjoyed that one. That was a solid steal. <laughs> solid grab, bitch. Yeah, I tried to return it. He didn't want it. He had another one, so. And back to the extreme hills with me. <laughs> Alright, this jungle doesn't seem to be working so well. So this is taking way too long. We had two Articunos before. I know, Mitch. This is, I think our idea of how long it's supposed to take has been tainted. <laughs> I think so, honestly. There we go. Oh, good old Gary. All right. Well, anyways, buddy. I think we're both in our positions that we need to be in. We're ready. We just need two more legendaries. 
Really only one because the Moltres just poofed away. And it's on to the fossils to finish this Pokedex. Exactly. And then we're all good. So, we'll see you dudes all next time. Hope you enjoyed. Slap that like button, and we'll see you next time. Take care. Bye, everybody.